Hello everybody and welcome back to a new quick video on my YouTube channel. I'm Nicholas and let's just say it like this, okay? Girl groups been dominating the month of August. We had Blackpink on Friday, we had IVE today, and now this Friday we got twice with their 11th mini album between 1 and 2. Honestly, not sure why they didn't wait with this album title for the 12th, you know, between 1 and 2, 12th album, you know, would have, would have made sense in some way, but it's for the 11th mini album coming out this Friday. We are going to be tuning into the album spoiler right now. Yeah, we're going to be checking out both the music video and the album this upcoming Friday. Very excited for it. Let's not waste any more time and let's just see what we can expect for the B-sides, okay? What we can expect for the B-sides, you know me, I'm always excited for twice, so let's check it out. Let's see what we got, what for concepts and ideas we have to sum around. That sounds like twice for sure. Is that the title? Was it the title? Oh. Oh, something more slow and more powerful. Ooh, I left the guitar there. The concept has been gorgeous though. I love the styling a lot. Chewy with the bank store. Queen of Hearts sounds amazing. Oh! Ooh, like a bright upbeat. Fast track. Ooh, that's hard to judge right now how that song will go. Okay, okay. Ooh, something more dancey. More like a disco dance song, okay. Ooh, that slow piano here. Oh, that should you look too, though. Uh huh. I think we had seven songs, right? Ooh, that's in. Production wise, this feels so clean. That you, the, the visuals of the, you know, Geo, oh my god, but... Oh. Ooh, those snippets are really good. Oh. Ooh, yeah, the vocals. Oh. Ballad twice? What means with ballad? You know, more of a uplifting sound. We you know I'm in for soft songs. Alright. Hey, this snippet is really clean, okay? The thing that I really enjoyed about this snippet is how, um, you know, how good the production sounds, okay? And how different each song sounded too, you know? Like, obviously, the tire track sounds very, very twice, okay? And all the other songs just carry that typical twice energy. But, like, the instrumentals still have such a different feeling too, you know? One is more synth-based, the other a bit slower and more focused on a bit of soft rock. The other goes a bit more into the dance disco direction. The other one goes a bit more, you know, a bit more stronger, a bit more powerful. That sounds really promising, Okay. That sounds really promising. I remember that their um, previous mini album. Oh, wait. Wait, no, 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 no. Um, I think Taste of Love was the 10th, right? Taste of Love was the 10th. Yeah, yeah. Never mind. I I'm still not the biggest fan of that album yet, even though I haven't listened to it in a while. Yeah, but like the other albums that came out last year and the Japanese album this year, these, those were excellent, okay? The two Japanese albums and Formula of Love, those were just all the way through really, really good. And this also feels really, really promising. Yeah, it's going to be my second twice mini album, actually. Yeah, it's going to be my second twice mini album. We still haven't done Eyes Wide Open, though, right? Too much other comeback stuff going around at the moment to, you know, do focus on some older stuff. But either way, this sounds really, really promising, okay? Again, talk that talk, I really gotta say talk that talk sounds really, really typical for twice as far, at least from the snippet. I hope that's going to be more exciting, you know, for the for the full thing. Queen of Thoughts sounded really good, okay? I really, really enjoyed the more slower paced, uh, you know, approach for that. Basics sounded really intriguing, really hard to judge at how the full thing will sound. You know, again, that's also the thing about those snippets. They, you know, catch my attention. They want me to, you know, find out, okay, how does the full thing feel like? How does the full thing look like? You know, that's always a good thing to do. Uh, or like a good thing when they do that. Trouble then, like mentioned. More dancey, upbeat, more fun. Again, chewy for uh, the styling in this album, though, okay? A lot of the styling is already top-notch, okay? If the quality of the, of the full songs will be just even half of it, then we're in for a really, really good album, okay? 
Then Brave, like mentioned, again, bright, bright tone, fast pace, you know, very, very twice like, but this time around has the synth going on, you know? That build up in the background. Mm. Vocally here too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This sounds really, really promising. Gone though too. You know, the more slow paced build up, the deep voice here. The Nyan GU vocals. Ooh, and they're like mentioned when we were kids, going to be the more cheerful, uh, soft ballad of the album. You know, like mentioned, not really a cl classical ballad, but more like a pop ballad. Okay, though, this sounds really, really promising. I'm excited, y'all. Again, so many cable releases. Being a multi stat, it's a blessing, okay? It's the best thing ever, okay? Blackpink into I've into Twice, into Billy and Mama Moo and whatnot at the end of the month as well. There's just so much great content out there from both boy group and girl groups. And I'm just so, so excited for this Friday when we're going to be checking out Twice's Child Track Talk That Talk and their 11th mini album between 1 and 2. I'm excited for it and we'll check it out. I know you guys will be sticking around on Friday to check it out alongside with me. Very excited for it. So yeah, if you enjoyed this short, uh, the short thoughts on the audio snippet, leave a like down below, leave a comment on your favorite uh, snippet thus far, and see you on Friday with the full album and music video. Thanks for watching, Unsis. Bye. Or once this, I actually don't know. Tell me about that too.